Woof woof! Hey guys, it's me Marcus, aka The Mad Dog, and we're back with another Batman Telltale video. Now it has been a bit of time and we're just going to jump right into it. If you haven't watched the last episode, I'd recommend catching up, but we did just see that the GCPD have invaded Wayne Manor. So we're clicking play right now and we are approaching Wayne Manor. Oh yeah, I'm still pretending that I'm playing hey, because hey, of the careful. fact that the footage corrupted itself, so it's kind of more like a reaction video. But let's see what so we've got here. This warrant. It's not personal. I had the boys turn the lights off, keep a low profile. I'm sorry, are you arresting me? Not unless I'm forced to. We're only collecting evidence today. I didn't do anything. That's so what we're here to find out. What today's topic is gonna Alfred, be somebody asked this enough. to me Make on sure Instagram. Only take what they have to. Of course, sir. It's gonna be about the mistakes that I've made on YouTube. Um I don't know if I should take that as an insult to somebody thinking that I have made a ton of mistakes, but I thought it'd be fun to talk about, now, you know, in case anybody else is trying to start a channel, maybe you've got a small channel as well, like me. Um, of residence, you know, so it's going to be fun to discuss. Any companies you own. Your holdings are extensive. And what do you expect to find? That's for our analysts back at the precinct to figure out. I when you bring the analysts comments. to there, like... It's a valid warrant. I gotta serve it. Mayor Hill signed off on this himself. As long Mayor's as he's mayor, corrupt. he calls the shots. Well, Hill has yeah. a history of making Like now it's kind of like guessing what past Marcus did. <laughs> Rumors and it. allegations, Mr. Wayne. If he but if they become fact, I'll handcuff him myself, same as any other crook. I don't know how your neck ended up on Mayor Hill's shopping block, but here we are. Hill knows if I go down, Harvey's I do really like the voice down. actors in this. Like, be a real I don't really think um, Troy Baker's any kind of Kevin Conroy, but especially um, Commissioner Gordon, he's really good in this. For us. For all our sakes, I pray you've got nothing to hide. But yeah, one of the mistakes that I made, what a lot of people don't realize is that I had a, another YouTube channel that I started back in like 2011, 2012, all about doing relationship advice and actually quite enjoyed it. I got about three and a half thousand subscribers on it at one point. Um, I just gave it up. You know, I thought going to university was a sound investment. I thought going into university was like a sound investment into my future. Um, stupid, I know. Ruth, stay back. Take whatever you want. You, you don't have to do this. <laughs> Can you imagine if somebody else was getting shot just in front of Bruce and that's how the shadows are working. having a good time. Bruce? Yeah. I didn't mean to interrupt, but... One of the mistakes that I made on that channel, I think, with how young this channel is, it doesn't really make sense <sighs> that I'd acknowledge any major mistakes because I should have already corrected them by <laughs> now if I knew this early on. There isn't that much mayor? for me to reflect Gotham on, if that makes any kind of sense. Of um, <laughs> really going for the record, huh? One mistake they made on that Listen, channel was, Bruce, you know, just surrounding a beloved family like yours captures not committing the to the attention. content that I wanted to do. I can help you get the right kind of attention. Sex tape. Through my connections at not the Gazette, me. I didn't do a sex tape. That wasn't one of my mistakes. I can dig I asked people whatever they said you now. need to fight this. <laughs> I think I completely forgot that the I pressed the silence button there. Evidence then. It just makes like it every really other awkward. Outlet. And it's all hearsay. Flimsy sources. There isn't a shred of hard proof. Still, allegations like this, they, they, they don't magically appear. Someone is going after my family. After me. Yeah, it was Joe Chell. Obviously, the sender didn't identify themselves. We have no idea who it could be. I mean, no one's even done their due diligence on this yet. The press saw the fumble, they grabbed the ball and ran. Carmine Falcone wants me to be in his pocket. He crashed Harvey's fundraiser and pretty much said, hop in. Well, maybe he thinks putting a little fear in you will make you jump. It won't. By tonight, this scandal will be broadcast to every screen in Gotham. Everyone will be But yeah, what I mean about not committing to your content is, through the rumor mill. I tended I to do videos that I think would have been popular or would have done well. Right here, right now, and stop it. You need but to the videos I enjoyed doing. Your side is what matters. 
Get Not quite... wild speculation. On the record, then. Whenever you're ready. Because, yeah, like, with that channel, I was doing a lot of, like, vlog-type stuff. I was doing, like, the Chubby family, Bunny Challenge and shit like that. that I don't really enjoy Understood. doing, like... I don't That's know if it comes across exactly in these videos. The people of Gotham need to hear. I don't know if it comes across in these videos, but... I like doing videos that may not be what everybody else is doing, but I fucking enjoy doing them. Like, these gameplay you're videos. You're gonna beat this, Bruce. The Waynes always come out on top. Goodbye, Miss Rail. She's so plasticky in this game. <laughs> but, um... I hate to admit it, but everyone smells smoke. A fire is heading this way. Batman has made plenty of enemies, but my family... We've done nothing but support Gotham, even in its darkest days. All this on the anniversary of your parents... It's not a coincidence. Harvey's the music is so good in this. He should have told me this was coming. Then find out why he didn't. Alfred's gonna break a kneecap or something, isn't he? But um, yeah, like with this channel, like the stuff that I've already tried to pursue, that I know isn't really popular, especially in the comic community, but it's just what I want to do, and I enjoy doing it. And I think on this channel in particular, yeah, you always become a bit of a different character. Um, when you've got a camera in front of you, it's not possible to be 100% the person you are outside of YouTube. Um, what the going on? But I feel so much more Wait, relaxed with this with channel. I feel like this the content just you flows a little bit smoother. Like, I make Keep longer videos and I don't What's feel like, like oh shit, shit, no one's going to watch me. It's like, I make longer videos and I enjoy making is. that video. So I think that's one mistake Mayor that Hill I made from that channel this? that I tried then to not make on this one. Everything um, just doing content that you enjoy. Computers, hard and the main thing is, files. Oh, son of a bitch. You're the they took his pawn. DA. They took his I pawn. I didn't know about this. I swear. Hill totally blindsided me on this one. God damn it. You, he blindsided he both of us. He has no right to issue search warrants without oh. my okay. <sighs> okay, I, I believe you, Harvey. Mayor Hill's trying to screw us both over with this move. And then he's made two enemies. Yeah, but you want two face yet, so I not that great of an it. enemy. Why would Hill stick his neck out over this? Just to tangle you up in some frivolous investigation? That just doesn't make sense. I mean, what could he possibly hope to accomplish other than a few cheap headlines? Do you think Falcone could be behind it? He didn't seem too thrilled after the fundraiser. Oh God, I wonder how different this would have been if I hadn't have gone into that I meeting room with Falco and if that was one of the choices. Sure if like Fanta shaked his hand or something like that. If I get in the way of this investigation, he would be able to spin it as a conflict of interest. And that wouldn't be good for either of us. Because sometimes with these games it gives you the illusion of choice, but it always kind of pushes you back into the storyline it wanted to we tell you. We fight back. Hill cannot get away with this. It may not be a war we can win. The city will be behind you, Harvey, just like I am. There you are. Hey, you? <gasps> Sorry. I got a habit of being late. No, no, just glad you made it. Why does everybody in this game walk like they shit themselves? You didn't oh, tell they me both we know, didn't they? Dinner. This is Selena. I hope I'm not interrupting anything. You were. Just election nonsense. I'm Bruce Wayne. So you are. Pleasure to meet you, Miss... Kyle. But yeah, another mistake that I made on that channel... It's a strong grip you've got there. ...was... Don't worry. ...trying to replicate other fall. people's styles. Oh, right. Don't Sorry. we think you can do on YouTube. Selena's new to town. Like, there's so many... In the comic community, there's already so many big players. People. You know, like, channels I look up to, like... Harv. I know well, our fanboy doesn't do videos anymore, the election, but there's them. Drive one there's, of those like, double-decker tour buses there's, around town. Omar, this gem. There's tons Not of like really. big names already in the comic. They haven't all been as welcome as um, YouTube scene. And I was mugged. If I tried to just copy what they do, let that masked freak nobody's going to be a better stuff. them than that. In the same way that nobody's going to be a better you than you. I should have called you a car. <laughs> no, you, you should have walked with it. Good right. enough to make an Good call. Well, I'll get Gordon down at GCPD to work on a lineup. It's probably long gone by now. Whatever that idiot took. I hope not. These were important materials. Ooh. Sensitive? Very. I don't know how I'm gonna explain this to my client. When things like this happen in my line of work, people tend to overreact. 
So what do you do? Oh, for I was going to say that's the type. It's complicated. Thing that someone I says and you go, I "What is your job?" Ah, stock market, huh? <laughs> Something like that. Like everybody has that friend, you just don't know what job they do. That press conference. Oof. Oof, oof. We've got it under control. Do you? I'll handle it. Someone at my office has to know what's going on. Uh, excuse me a moment. That phone wasn't ringing. Hey, it's Harvey. But yeah, so another mistake that I made on my other channel was trying to replicate other channels that don't even exist anymore. Like, when you think about it, look at 10 years ago on YouTube, the biggest channels were stuff like Smosh, Tobuscus, Jenna Marbles, um, Ray William Johnson, I think that was his name. And then you look now and it's a completely different That's generation of YouTubers. So you don't want to pretend to be someone else. And then if like their time goes, your time will definitely go. You need to craft your own sort of identity. This a lot, actually. Like, me and Highland G How were talking about it. That fancy armor, it it's toys. nice to be able to just be yourself in this Ooh, YouTube community. Like, like I know the woof woof's dumb, Not but it's my mention. kind of dumb. Like, Everyone if I didn't say it at the beginning of the video, now all everybody about the wonder if it's right. the same video, it's if it's the same channel. Hit me. Sorry to hear that. Don't worry, I'm not gonna expose you yet. Can't I'm curious he about just something now. I do what I do for money, but you're Bruce Wayne. What's your excuse? Vengeance. It's vengeance. I have to. Mm. But you, why take the risk? I think you know enough already. Honestly, I don't the think anybody's ever said no excuses without it immediately being followed with an away. excuse. How disappointing. No excuses, I just had an ingrowing toenail you know that day. That like, everybody does it. I want it back. This is awkward for me. As I recall, you took something from me too. Hope you're getting some use out of that grappling gun. I'm sure he's got I'm more interested in how I can use you. These people I'm working for, they don't screw around. If I fail to deliver that drive, it's going to cost a lot more than money. Well, looks like you've made your bed. No, we've made this bed, and I'm not going to lie in it alone. You owe me. If they don't get what they want, there will be consequences. I don't Bitch, like no, I don't. consequences. No, oh, you don't need my help. You seem pretty capable of handling this yourself. So yeah, that was something I wanted to oh, do on this channel. Whether anybody liked what I was doing or not. I wanted to at least know that you yeah, liked or not. didn't like the channel because it was me and I was being Listen, myself. I don't have like, a lot of time. Your channel's probably going to get hated for some reason at some point. Like, I've already had a bit of hate and I'm Just give it back. not even six yeah, months into it. No. It's, one of them, no. it's part and parcel of being on YouTube. Drive. But... I'd rather be hated for who you I am. Because really you're going to get hated either way. You are. And you'll be pissed off if I was hoping you'd come out and play. you really start getting a lot of shit. And you weren't even being yourself. You didn't even right enjoy the stuff that you did. No. My contact. And as well, be for the most part, a lot of people don't seem to understand no when you're telling a joke you on YouTube. They seem to think <laughs> everything you say is 100% your honest right actual feelings. So... I think you can't really do a video Maybe being scared you know? of any particular reaction or anything like that. You if you've got me. an opinion, say it, as long as you can justify it, We're it's gonna fine. straighten everything out. I feel better already. Sorry, but I've got to run. So soon? Aren't you going to stay for a drink? Yeah, Bruce. Stay for a drink? <laughs> what did they both <laughs> I love to, got another appointment and I really don't want to be late for it. Oh, all right then. Don't forget to change into your suit. Is that the end of the scene? I'm assuming so. We've got a big transition now into him just walking as Batman. That'd be really cool. Oh, well, it's not gonna do it. Yeah, so that's something I definitely Alfred, recommend that I'm you. Warehouse. No sign you stay true to yourself. Whether it's going to get you loved or it's hated, quiet. make sure that you know who you are on YouTube. Like, it's all well and good having a character. You know. Being the mad dog, it sort of just helps me get a little bit more confidence. Um, the sound of an ambush sounds like Alfred's album when he was talking about fire and smoke and stuff like that. <laughs> Do 
DJ. No idea why I struggled that much with the door. This One mistake I used to make um, on my other channels, and I, I made it once on this channel. I am way too eager to jump into an argument, which is something on YouTube you really can't you can't be arguing with a lot of people. That's what I'm gonna find out. You know, you kind of like I work in customer Lord, services. Eastside Docks, Warehouse 135. And you kind of have to have that same mentality that you know everybody is a potential customer. Even if somebody's coming up and just going, "You're shit," and you can't grow a beard, like they clearly aren't talking to me. But you have to kind of be able to just go, "Okay, cool." Nothing left like, to bear. Not go, "Well, you're shit, and you can't grow a beard." Like I used to take something called critical thinking. Which is basically how to argue professionally, so I love a good argument. Analyzing. And I very rarely try to avoid them, but chemical. Potential your channel's your reputation. Nervous. If you're coming across as a dickhead, even if somebody's a dickhead to you, a lot of people won't see it like that. They'll just see you arguing with someone on your channel. Further analysis. Bit of a shame, but wish. it's better to just be able to avoid those situations. And that is definitely a mistake that I made. Um, <laughs> Especially my old channel, like I went back and forth for months with some people. Whereas now, it did so with enough force to obliterate the person standing next to it. But the chemicals themselves were inert, not explosive. Well, it appears yeah, now I'm pretty big boom. I'll see what I can piece back. I'm 26, I've got a mortgage, I've got bills paid, I've got a full time job. I don't really have time to be arguing with people. I, I prefer focus on the people who comment, and it's like. I've Yo, seen these outfits I enjoyed the video where they're like, hey, do you mind just tweaking Same this and stuff like that? that. But city hall. I'm never going to be annoyed at somebody who comes at me with constructive criticism. Like, there's people who are my friends on YouTube that, you know, have come back to me and said, like, you know, that background music's awful. You really need to change it. And I the think on YouTube, you can't take any of that stuff personally. Door. Especially if they're your friend, they want your content to be good. You should be asking people, like, how can I improve? And that's something I didn't do early enough on this channel. It's going to be another scene that I can't open the door. Looks like a bullet started this. A normal bullet couldn't have caused that explosion. Doesn't appear normal. The point of entry is melted. I'm no good at stuff like this. Like, I much prefer when a game literally tells me what to do. I. White Rose. Falcone's calling card. He's been busy as of late. Send the drones hunting. I want to know his every move. Why don't you send the drones to do everything? That sounds like a much more like effective solution. No. But yeah, like I keep going to people for feedback on these type of videos because. I've never done any kind of gaming content before this, and like I said, I want to be good at it by the time I do stuff like Batman Arkham. So this is stuff that I'm actively trying to get feedback on, like, do I talk too much? Do I not talk enough? Should I make sure that my footage isn't corrupted so that I have to basically do a reaction video? Who knows? Skylight Club. Hmm. That's in case he wants Blaze up after. Oh, this is gonna be gross shit. And see, well, that texture's awful. Badly burned. But the damage seems to originate from inside his skull. It's got one of those what Judge Dread incendiary rounds, anti. I watched that again the other night. You know, Dread 3D. Such a shame that it just didn't get a sequel. Oh. Imagine if you were like. The family of that police officer, and like you go to the body, it's like, why is there a hole in the side of his head? And it's like, Batman fished a bullet out of him. Sensors say it's an incendiary. You wouldn't be too disappointed then. Phosphorus residue. This could have superheated the contents of the canister, causing the aforementioned boom. What does Alfred do whilst he's waiting for Batman 
to just say random stuff. Blood, broken nails. Probably back to those bars that we were talking about earlier. Shredded this murk to pieces, barehanded. God, what would cause someone to do that? The nerve agent could make them psychotic. Really glad I chose red, though. It's really impacting my gameplay experience. I have no idea what I've got to link any of this to. I think at this point I was just trying my luck with it all. But yeah, I don't know about anybody else, but, but so. lately do the weeks Your feel like truth. they're getting even longer for people? Because they do for me, like, I'm doing this at the end of my work week and I'm I'm just so knackered. Like, how, do, how did I used to do this before lockdown? It just looks like he's giving it a thumbs up, like, still boosted. The bullet that killed the cop is the same type that blew up the canister. Well, I'm sure they didn't find that at a local gun store. Oh, it appears bad. military. Hmm. Canisters were stored here. Canisters of what? Something was here when the explosion occurred. Like that too. Scorched area. Oh, completely missed that guy. It's a cop. The force grows thin. It's a shot today. cop like a shot girl. Like, that's my only point of reference at this point. Imagine if there was CCTV footage of this warehouse so you could just see Batman wandering around not having a clue what's going on. Someone drove off after the explosion. Have you put it together? Yes. Falcone leaving his rose here. This is a message. Dead cops, stolen chemicals. He's making a big move. I'd leave a more clear message like... His snipers hit a canister with an incendiary bullet, causing it to superheat and explode. This may have been a distraction or a way of destroying evidence. Or both. Cops move in to stop the detective theft. if you don't consider both. Tony's men gun them down. Then things turn grim. That's sounded pretty grim Possibly before, man. The psychoactive nerve agent. A cop ripped up a merc's face with his bare hands. And was put down. Same sniper, same type of bullet. Looks like Falcone's men got what they wanted and escaped. Have you located the shooter? No, but based on two impact trajectories, the canister and the dead cop, the shooter could only have a clear shot from Inside there. Inside the building. There. See. Or there. And would have contaminated himself with the phosphorus residue. Program the skimmers to pick up that signature. Right away, sir. I bet this is going to be one of them things that is always going to be the last place that you choose. Do you know, like every time Uncharted or something did something like this?
both targets could have been shot from here, but no phosphorus. But yeah, I also think another mistake that I made with YouTube was not sticking with it when it wasn't going my way. Like YouTube is like the ocean. We're gonna get all philosophical now. Yeah, YouTube's like the ocean. Sometimes the waves are high and everything's going well for you. Sometimes the waves are low, and it's very rarely a comment on you as a creator. Not a bad angle. Like, no sometimes, process, especially though. in the early days, I know I do this in particular. If anybody unsubscribes or if you lose a subscriber, you panic. Like, you can have a hundred subscribers, and one can unsubscribe, and you'll think that your channel's doing shit. You kind of have to take a step back and go, you know, sometimes people delete their accounts. Sometimes people grow out of your content. Sometimes people have accidentally subscribed to your channel. You have to look at more of the interaction, like, you know, spike. I get people messaging me on Instagram and a lot of like people just saying, hey, really enjoy your videos. And it's like, always seems to come at a time when I'm having a bit of a shit day. So I do really appreciate when people say stuff like that. Especially this past month when we've been ill, when we've been back at work, it's been really difficult to to get back and get videos done. Like I don't have as much time to do them anymore, which is a shame, but I don't want to lose my momentum. Because I think so momentum- Where did he go? Where did he go? Just follow that trail. There you go, Batman. But yeah. Trace you have to be able to try and find a way to keep your momentum, try and balance out your content. Like I can't just do Found 10 it. Telltale Batman games because people would unsubscribe that might create what they subscribe for. These are more like, extra content that I enjoy doing is just like a sort of side piece. Um, there he is, found him. My turn. <laughs> Completely messed up. Don't make me add your corpse to this graveyard. No, Coney, why did he do this? I, I ain't telling you nothing. Is that solely from Uncharted? You, Punch him. You can't make me talk. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't telling you, Jack. You trying to scare a confession out of me? I won't break. Your bones will. <laughs> when you just drag his face into the phosphorus, that sounds pretty painful. What was that game, Spec Ops Align? Oh, that bit with the phosphorus bombs just goes through me every time. About you. You're a freaking animal. Don't say anything. Yep. But I ain't afraid of you. You know you can bleed to death without ever spilling a drop. <laughs> All on the inside. Tell me the plan, or I start swinging. Do I get hit in? Ribs. <laughs> Tell me. That cab woman was supposed to hand over a drive, had the container number we needed, but she flaked. So we had to find it ourselves. Uh, container by container. Someone must have heard us, called the cops. We were told no witnesses. Why risk open war with the GCPD? Some kind of chemicals. Falcone wanted them. What are the Typical. chemicals for? We were paid to steal them, not ask questions. How much would you have to be paid to ask questions? No! Stop! You, you can't do that! Oh, please, no! Just do it. I start here and keep breaking until you answer. The chemicals are some kind of explosive. A weapon. I don't know. Balcone said he'd use them soon. Used? Where? That's all I know! I swear, I swear! I told you everything I know! Just break it. Yeah. They've got wind. They've again. got wind. Oh, God. Jesus Christ. These are cops. Get an ambulance in here. I think I need to call the coroner instead. I talked to Gordon. But yeah, those are what I'd say are some of the mistakes I've made previously on YouTube. Um, there's probably more that I can go and make. I'm a bit of an idiot. I always just try and do what I think right in the moment. It doesn't always work. First to everything. But as long as you, there's some of you guys enjoying these videos, I haven't made that many mistakes. And 
If but you just say don't, another word, just hope I don't write I anyone will. down, that's the main thing. I don't care if half the city thinks you're a hero. Mm. Right now, you're a suspect. Shoot me. See what happens. I will. I swear to God, I will. Do it, bro. You're making a mistake, Do it, bro. Detective. You want to hear what I have to say. Falcone stole a shipment of chemicals. Appears to be a weaponized nerve agent. Causes people to go berserk. Turn violent. We need to act before he releases it. I got a task force on it. You already have one. <sighs> You're taking this too far, Bruce. That was a pretty cool line. Okay, so we're going to end the video there. Like I said, I'm still getting into the flow of this gameplay content. I'm having like the slowest week of my life. So I'm sorry if I haven't got as much energy as I usually do, but I'm really hoping that you guys enjoyed this video and that you're enjoying this series as a whole. Like I said, it's fun talking about other stuff, not even necessarily just comics, but being able to just sit down, talk while some gameplay is going on as well. Because besides the live streams, I don't really feel like I get much chance to do that. I am planning on doing a live stream this coming Friday and I've got a special guest with me. If you've seen me in someone else's live stream, you can very easily guess who that special guest is. So look forward to that if you're watching this as it comes out. And um, like I said, it's this coming Friday and it's something I'm really looking forward to doing. I love the last live stream. It was so cool how like two hours just flew by like that. There's so many of you just, you know, staying involved in the chat, especially when I was having technical difficulties. And I just really appreciate it because yeah, before that, I was nervous as anything. I was like, you know, you can't call yourself a mad dog and then just be nervous the first time you're doing a live stream. So you guys really helped me with that and I really appreciate it. And there's just so much love and support that comes out on this channel, especially new enough with every single video, which I just really appreciate. Um, I hope you continue to support this series. It's something that I'm looking to branch into other games and do, and hopefully then, you know, I'll get more time to commentate really weird game to commentate over but i just want to get the skills to you know do gameplay and videos at the same time so just really hoping you enjoy it like i said thank you again for supporting the channel especially this month where things have been a little bit slow i'm hoping i can get back into a rhythm now that i'm not feeling as ill as i did a few weeks ago but if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and if you didn't like this video why did you get this far please subscribe if you haven't done so already and in the live stream i might announce what i've got planned and um, for if we hit a thousand subscribers so look forward to that um, and the easiest way to see that is like i said subscribe and click the bell notification check out my links i'm always posting comic content up on there and i can keep you up to date on videos that are coming out and if you do want to support the channel it's greatly appreciated and i'm not going to ask for your money in a donation or a patreon or something like that all i ask is that you treat yourself to a book maybe a game or maybe a movie and just use one of the amazon affiliate links down below but hopefully i'll see all you guys at the live stream and there's going to be videos coming out in the week but until then just make sure that you stay safe keep reading and keep barking all your mad dogs and i'll see you at the next video